Okay, viewers. So in the previous video lecture, we saw this thing that how to solve a recurrent solution. Uh, now in uh, this video lecture, we want to solve some more questions of the recurrent solution. Okay. See uh, this example. This is example number two. An minus 7 a n minus 1 plus 12 a n minus 2 equal 0 okay. so check what is its order okay. so what is its order okay. its order is n minus n it is 2 okay. so what is the order order here is 2 so therefore, its characteristic equation is its characteristic equation is as the order is two, so start with alpha square, okay, and then b seven alpha plus twelve. So factorize uh, this equation so it is alpha square minus 4 alpha plus 3 alpha plus 12 equal to 0 okay so take alpha common from here alpha inverse alpha minus take minus 3 common this alpha minus 3 are equal to 0 alpha minus 3 alpha minus 4 equal to 0 so what is the value of alpha and okay so see as both the values they are different so it means that its solution is c1 uh, 3 raised to the power n uh, plus 3 to 4 raised to the power okay see this power it depends on your subscript okay if your subscript it is in n then you write your final answer in uh, n and if this subscript is in k then you write your final answer in k so you people uh, means remember this thing always i just show you one example by taking the subscript k okay uh, so see the next example which is example number 3 okay uh, like uh, a k uh, minus 4 times a k minus 1 okay uh, plus Four times a k minus two equal to zero. Okay. So what is its order? Okay. Its order is uh, k minus k minus. So it is k minus k plus two. It is two. Okay. Uh, so therefore, uh, its characteristic equation is. Therefore, its characteristic. Equation is alpha square minus 4 alpha plus 4 equal to 0. So this can be written as alpha square minus 2 alpha minus 2 alpha plus 4 equal to 0. Take alpha common from here alpha into alpha minus 2. Take minus 2 common from here alpha minus 2 equal to 0. So what do you get from here? Alpha minus 2 and alpha minus 2 equal to 0. Okay. So what are the values of alpha? It is 2 and 0. Okay. So here we have repeated roots. Okay. Here we have repeated roots. So for the repeated roots, we write the solution as C1 plus C2 k bracket 2 raised to the power k. Okay. Uh, as this subscript is in k, so that is why we are writing here k and k. Okay. If it is in n, then write here n n okay so it all depends that uh, what subscript you are using in the question now we solve one more example the question is say that a n minus 10 a n minus 1 uh, plus 25 a n minus 2 equal to 0 okay so what is its order its order is 10 minus so it is 2 okay so 
its characteristic equation is its characteristic equation is alpha square minus 10 alpha plus 25 equal to 0 so alpha square minus 5 alpha minus 5 alpha plus 25 equal to 0 okay so what it is uh, take alpha common from this alpha into alpha minus 5 take minus 5 common then it is alpha minus 5 equal to 0 so it is alpha minus 5 into 10 alpha minus 5 so what are the values of alpha 5 and 10 so therefore the solution is c1 plus c to n uh, into 5 raised to power so in this way you can try a similar type of problem for your from your book okay so thank you very much viewer for watching this video more about it will be discussed in the next lecture